Okay, we are back, and I, I just wanted to put out like a public service announcement, okay, if you will. Uh, my wife and I, uh, you, you know, a while back started using, uh, and I'm not getting paid to advertise for them at all, although they should. They could break off some money for me. Um, <clears throat> these are, uh, um, they're, they're plant-based soap for uh uh your laundry but they're little paper sheets and uh one box so first of all you know the box is cardboard or you know uh, it can be you know recycled um and so this is th these are great this is for 57 loads it comes in a two pack so you get 114 loads right here they're these pieces of paper that are basically freeze-dried soap and you throw it right in the washing machine and it's done. That's it. You do it. It's by a company called Ecos. It's uh, hyperallogenic. It takes up no space. So, but they were a little back ordered. So we had to buy some conventional uh, detergent, if you will. Uh, and this is 66 loads. Let's just think about this for a second. This is 66 loads. This one right here. It's plastic. So this container if it doesn't get recycled, we'll be around for a thousand years, uh, leaching plastic into the water and, and microplastics as it breaks down all, cause it's never really going to break down and check this out. This thing is 90% water. Okay. And most of the detergents that come in containers like this are 90% water, 10% soap. But when you put in a freeze dried, or dried out sheet of soap, it's like a hundred percent once it hits water, and you've got you've got the ten percent that was in this. Okay, so just think about the eighteen wheelers carrying pallets of this from warehouses across the country, all different kinds, whether it be Tide or Whisk or whatever, and they're driving cross country using up fuel. The storage space for this is ridiculous in these containers on pallets. And then all this plastic is going to stay around forever where this cardboard box will deteriorate uh, or be recycled into something else. So all I'm saying is there's options out there and I don't want to be preachy, but it's kind of like if you care enough, you can find the answers to help fix the problems and the pollution and all that stuff going on in the world. It takes a little effort and I'm hoping that someday soon all the major corporations that produced whisk and that produced tide and that produce all these things are going to come up with the same solution and have these little sheets that just go into your washing machine and dissolve and that's it. Okay, and just stop with the plastic. Stop using all this water, 90% water in these containers, just so that it's a liquid solution when you can just do this. Come on, it's a no brainer. Okay, so look, Ecos plant powered, hypoallergenic. This is Magnolia Lily, the scent. Uh, non-toxic stain fighting enzymes are in it. This is a 114 load two pack. And you know, you have to, you order it from Amazon. I, I haven't seen them in stores. So there are solutions out there. You guys should think about this. Okay. Versus this.